Today, I'm going to show you how to use custom properties to filter a widget. First, we need to define our custom properties. Settings, all settings. Under node and group management, manage custom properties. And for our demonstration, I'm going to use deployment stage, which is one I created. This custom property defines what the current deployment stage is for a device. And it only has four options, all of which are locked. So this makes it ideal for filtering. To build the filter, we'll go to the widget in question. In this example, I'm going to edit the all nodes resource on the summary page. So edit. Under filter nodes, this is where you use your custom property to filter the resource. So put in your custom property and the value you want to use for the filter, and then submit. And you can now see we have a significantly shorter list because it has been filtered. It's also helpful to rename the resource indicating the filter. And that's how you use custom properties to filter a widget. Looking for more information on this topic, the SolarWinds Customer Success Center provides all the information you need to install, troubleshoot, and optimize your SolarWinds products. Visit the SolarWinds Customer Success Center.